Hey everyone, welcome back. I am back today with more Attack on Titan. I am so excited, you guys. If you're joining me early today, it means you are one of my awesome patrons. Thank you so much. And you know, as always, I'm sending you those big old hugs right through the screen. And if not, still thank you for joining me today. I'm glad you're here. I do hope you'll consider supporting me that way. The link to my Patreon is going to be in the description down below. So we had kind of a big win <laughs> on Attack on Titan last episode. Um, so I don't want to take away from how big their victory was, but even the episode itself made a pretty big um, statement in terms of the, the victory really being overshadowed by an awful lot of loss. Um, which, uh, you know, I mean, that is, that is battle for you. I mean, that's usually, sometimes all you hear about is like the good stuff, but the loss is tremendous. Um, I was so shocked that Marco died. I'm like, well, he just died off screen? Or like, did he die on screen and I just blinked and missed it? Maybe, that's maybe possible, but like, John seemed really surprised too. Like, last we saw, all four of them had like, made it out okay. Um, but, man, just all that death, all that carnage, like, to be a kid just living in this world and dealing with that, that is, I mean, no wonder Aaron's starting to get a little loopy. Like, he's not starting. He's, he's there. <laughs> and he's been there for a while, maybe. But, you know, like, last time I was saying, okay, so, it's not like Aaron's ever been, you know, like, super stable, but... I do feel like living in this really crummy world and also um, possibly the toll of turning into the Titan over and over um, are really having an effect on him. Perhaps. Perhaps I'm reading it wrong. I think at least physically they're having a toll. Um, but I'd, I'd venture to guess that we're probably going to see that they take a toll mentally as well. Um, so... Aaron is now part of the Survey Corps, which, yay, promotion for Aaron, but he kind of got promoted based on, like, the wild gleam in his eye when it came to slaughtering Titans, and, um, Levi was, like, not really on board with him before that, but then after that he was like, okay, like, I can get on board with <laughs> So it'll be interesting to see more about Levi, Levi and how those two get along. And I'm very, very, I've been curious about Levi for a while. And I said like last time, man, he's a boss. And now I'm like, now that he's interacting with our crew, I'm like, I still think that. But now I'm also like seeing some other stuff. So we'll see. We'll see about him. Um, still really proud of our main trio. Um, a lot of death last episode. Very sad. So... As we ended last episode, it sounded as if um, part of the plan was to go retake the walls using Aaron's Titan abilities and get to the basement. So it looks like Aaron's dad is still missing. Um, I was under the assumption that whatever experiment was done on Aaron um, to make him into a Titan or give him the ability to turn into a Titan was done in conjunction by his dad in the military. First, I just saw his dad, because we kept seeing the flashbacks. But then they were like, hey, he's part of a top secret experiment. So I'm like, so the military was on this too? I mean, not really sure of the specifics. And they haven't really said the specifics. And I'm sure there's a reason for that, um, that we will get to shortly. Hopefully. Oh my god, I hope they tell me soon. Every episode, you guys, is just like, Less answers, more questions. Um, but you know I love it. Like, it, it just, it keeps me hooked so much. This show is never boring, I will say that. Um, so, really enjoying it. Again, probably, maybe even a little past the halfway point now. I do not look ahead at all, like, even on Crunchyroll, because I'm terrified, like, the thumbnail or the... Or the title of the episode will spoil something. So I really don't know how many episodes there are in this season. Um, but I'm assuming it's somewhere in the 20s. So we're, uh, we're, we're probably pretty well over the halfway point now. Or at least at the halfway point. So, um, wow. We have a lot of ground to cover. 
I cannot wait to see what happens next. So hopefully it will be um, another win for our crew and maybe a win without as much carnage this time, but we'll see. Um, this is a pretty bleak show, so um, I'm, not ex I'm not expecting, sadly, I'm not expecting a beach episode anytime soon. Um, which is funny because I said that like early on in the show and then I learned like they don't even know what the beach is. I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> We can't even have a beach episode now. These poor children do not even know what a beach is. Maybe that's how they'll find out in the beach episode. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Maybe it'll happen. There's only one way to find out, you guys, and that is to jump right in to the next episode of Attack on Titan. Let's do this. <laughs> That's a lot of rumors. Yeah, I mean, that could be a really good thing. Oh, so we're very divided on this. Oh. Oh, he's in demand. Okay, that's who that is. Oh. Oh, great. Well, at least they can vouch for him. I, I, I don't get it. But he saved that whole wall. Of course not. On their way to defend you? Oh, I can't believe he's like imprisoned like that. I mean, I can and I can't. I get the whole Titan thing. <laughs> what the? Wow! Talk about an entrance. <sighs> now that you've scared him to death. <laughs> Is he sniffing him? <laughs> Um, okay. They gave him a squad. All right. Well, wow. Okay. He's on trial now. Wow. This is daunting. Sight for sore eyes. Oh, please be a decent human being. Okay, so military police wants to kill him. That makes a whole lot more sense. Short but sweet. Okay, 
ああ、ヒスプリーチンオーバーヒアリズに食うに困っている人間はテネーラ豚ともの視界に入らねえとおてんトビラスよこれまで通り兵士として人類に貢献し巨人の力を行使できるのかはいできますとクリアンスアズイ
理解してます。Okay, so they were trying to help him out. All right, all right. あるでしょう。歯が折れちゃったんだよ。Oh. 広いな。気持ち悪い。俺だって大事なサンプルだし。I was gonna say, hang on to that. Um, this is getting a little uncomfortable, but okay. Doing a little dental exam here. It grew back. Oh my god, it grew back. Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, let's talk, you guys. Very, very big stuff going on. Um, So the trial was very、um, intense and unnerving, and I was on the edge of my seat pretty much the whole time.、Um, so I can see how there's a lot of just like civil unrest about this whole Aaron being a Titan thing. And this is just kind of a personal theory of mine, but it was sort of mentioned、um, a few episodes ago when Pixie said, you know, people were fighting, and it's. You know, kind of. There's this、uh, legend, fairy tale that says that the Titans came about because you know they needed to unite the people. And first of all, that obviously didn't work because we just saw like there was a lot of infighting. <laughs> it's just, it's just what people do. You know, it's just it. It's it is what it is.、Um, but also. This whole thing, just the way that everything's run, and the whole way that the society works, it just begs the question: Is someone in control here? Um, because I've all I've been seeing for a while, like possibly, um, but now now I wonder. And so we got. We've seen this a little bit in the past, but we got a little bit more about it in this one when Aaron just like started going off, which I was like, I was like, yeah, you probably shouldn't, but okay, like I will most definitely watch this and enjoy it.、Um, you know, just the way that the、um, the rich and elite and their society seem to have a lot of control over everything, which is what you'd expect, you know,、um, but also they have a lot of say and a lot of power. And there was that other little group that. Um, Aaron was saying like, "Hey, they didn't really have a lot of power a few years ago. Now they seem to have a lot of power. So that's another thing I'm keeping an eye on. But you know, they seem to have an awful lot of power, but they don't. <laughs> like as we saw from that one guy in the episode about Mikasa, who was like, just thought he was God's gift and wanted his like giant pile of stuff moved out of the wall、uh, because he needed it."、Um, And he just thought, you know, he was so entitled, and that basically the soldiers are like pawns, and like they pay for them to like go and be pawns, basically, and and just like die. That's just what they do.、Um, so there's an awful lot of that. That's one thing I picked up on too, like during Aaron's rant. I'm like, they're they're really driving this home that like that's how it works, and I'm I'm I want to see more. I want to see more about that, and I'm curious about that. But man, the trial though was very intense.、Um, I'm so glad Mikasa got to explain herself because I would have been so like boiling mad had we not gotten a little,、um, you know, just yes, he threatened her, but like, I mean, I'll back up for a second because I was under the impression the military. Were the ones who did this experiment on him, or they at least had a say in it, or had something to do with it? And now they're like, "No, you need to die." Like, why did you do it then? Also, it may have just been something Aaron's dad did to him. I'm not sure. The military seemed very aware of it, and they seemed in on it. So I'm assuming like they were in on it.、Um, but anyway, I'm I'm all over the place. So let me get back here.、Um, so. It just—it、uh, seems like he would make a more powerful ally if he was able to get his power under control. Like that could be the key if they could hone this with him, and possibly like I'm not saying this is a good or right thing to do, but this seems like something that would make sense to someone in the military. If they could do that to like ten different people, they could probably wipe out the Titans.、Um, again, if someone wants the Titans around. 
that could be a problem. That could be another reason they want Aaron out of the picture, which is kind of what I was getting at with my whole long big thing. Um, so Levi, <laughs> Levi scares me. I know he was just trying to help, but man, that was intense. And Mikasa was like a millisecond away from just, I don't know. I mean, Levi might even give her a run for her money, but, um, I, I, I think, I think she would have held her own at least taken him out. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. He seems pretty powerful, but I mean, Mikasa is Mikasa. So there you go. Um, I'm really curious to see where things go next. They finally did manage to talk um, the court, the judge, into um, letting them venture out beyond the wall. And kind of sounds like they're going to train Aaron in his Titan state, which I think he needs, but I really hope that the whole like beating thing wasn't a part of that because that doesn't seem nice. But um, I'm dying to know what is going on with this basement? What is this mystery of the Titans? What is going on? Um, hopefully I will find out soon. <laughs> we'll see. Also, big reveal at the end there that Aaron, even when he's not a Titan now, is regenerating. That is so, that is a huge asset right there because he can fight Titans and lose limbs and stuff and still be okay, which I'm guessing is how he, you know, I just assumed it had something to do with like he was in, he had turned into a Titan, so he regenerated his limbs that he lost, but it's not just when he's a Titan. So that, that is pretty, pretty flippin' cool, you guys. Can't wait to see what happens next. I'll wrap this up because I'll just go on forever just theorizing and, um, conspiracy theorizing and all that good stuff, but I'm really liking it. Can't wait to see what happens next. You guys, thank you so much for joining me. Please join me next time and we'll watch it together. Bye for now, guys.